So, one of the hunters that I feel like is a little bit underplayed and gets pretty much... I'd say probably 20% of the attention that every other hunter in this game gets has to be Amu Zinkab. I don't know why, except for the fact that he has low mobility, but that seems to be a thing that many hunters have. This guy is pretty good compared to all the hunters right now in the meta, and he seems to be up on the rise as it seems like because as always whenever a god gets a skin he gets more playtime and this is a god that's gotten two skins in general period besides his mastery skins and i think a uh, tier two skin i don't think that really counts because you can buy that that's nothing special um they have two exclusive skins one which is a ranked skin and this skin which is a season ticket skin for the year which looks amazing if you can't see uh, or can't tell i guess uh it looks just stunning i love the effects the voice pack is great he's uh very powerful as uh, since his buff which wasn't really that much of a buff this happened sometime last year uh, where basically they made as you saw the hive when you place the hive it gives you this radius it's sort of um word radius so when people walk in it it'll show you where they're at and it gives you attack speed it gives you movement speed that's pretty much your way to get away sadly you don't have much of a getaway unless you don't have that so if you see an amc in ranked or something like that he's probably going to get far in the majority of the time which kind of sucks and pretty much the only reason why i do not play this god in ranked or any other mode and i will never play ranked ever again ranked sucks on console just throwing that out there if anyone's curious it's absolutely horrible don't waste your time stick to casuals and just have a game where people actually stay in your lobbies because my god i've played ranked this week and everyone left my games uh, i was the worst experience i think i've ever had with this game but anyways um back to amc i'm sorry about that uh he's a lot of fun from what i've been playing lately uh if you have a pretty good team he seems to be viable in some situations especially because he has a slow that's absolutely enormous uh you get this slow you get this ability and it, it already does 20 percent slow which is the max so there's no upgrading it there's no upgrading it and getting like a bigger slow it doesn't start at five percent and then you work your way up it starts exactly at 20 percent so in early game mid game late game he's very potent uh, especially i feel like in early game because he has so much of an aoe uh radius pretty much when you put your hive down and you put your three and you shoot your two which is the hive which is that little that big orb that you just saw you could just control the entire lane it's it's insane it's great and it's pretty much why he's one of the biggest bands in duel and uh, he doesn't really get banned in, in other modes because nobody plays him because if you play him in other modes you're probably going to get farmed which really sucks and pretty much one of the reasons why he doesn't get played that often same thing along the lines of exit ball hey he's uh he's not i wouldn't say he's easy to farm but he's just not that great sadly and uh it's pretty much just all the other hunters are just better you have things like scotty and Ulu right right now which are uh just pretty much up there at the moment and apollo things like that you know who everyone just seems to play at the moment but this guy's extremely fun if you want to just have a decent entertaining match where you have a good amount of damage throughout the entirety of the game you don't feel that much underpowered in most situations unless you have a team that focuses you or just takes you down. This will be your guy. He does just fine. He's not overpowered. He's not underpowered. He does the thing that he wants to do correctly when needed. So, again, I hope you all enjoyed the little video for today. I didn't really have much footage, Sally, so I kind of went with what I had. I have been streaming a lot lately. That's why I have been having a very severely lack of videos, and I'm very, very sorry about that. Uh, yes, check out my channel. It's going to be in the description. I did do like a little thing on my banner at the end. It's on Beam. I uh, hope you all enjoy the video for today and take care.